um, welcome back to another YouTube video. It is your girl Lin Wei, and there's absolutely no way without going through the way, and we believe that Jesus Christ is the way. The video I'm making today is not one that I like was expected myself to make today because this video I was supposed to probably record it tomorrow, but then tomorrow is Thursday and I wanna release a holy perspective video. So I was just sitting, you know? I was sitting, editing pictures, videos and other stuff, just focusing on something completely and entirely different than what God is leading me to do now. And then, cause I burst into tears when I watched this video, I'm just going to play a video. Um, it might be inappropriate, so precaution, hold yourself. If you are not comfortable with hearing certain things, I recommend that you don't um, stay and listen to this uh, part of the video, or you can skip it because, um, yeah it's really gruesome and stuff so yeah but anyway here's the video I'm ju i'll just replay it because i literally just watched it as you can see like i was crying but like this is just tears in my eyes i was genuinely in tears uh but let me just play the vid the sound again like each other's blood might mislead people or like people are imagining us with like goblets and we're like game of thrones drinking each other's blood it's just a few drops but yes, we do consume each other's blood on occasion for ritual purposes only. <laughs> it is used for a reason and it is controlled where it's like, let's shed a few drops of blood and each drink it. He's much more haphazard and hectic and chaotic where he's willing to just like cut his chest open with broken glass and be like, take my soul. So, <laughs> when I... <laughs> Yo, the minute I listened to that vote, like, I saw it was trending, like, I saw Ruslan posted about it, I saw it, like, on my YouTube, but I didn't, like, watch any video as of yet, because I was busy the whole day, but then when I was listening to it now, obviously, I don't want to hear the whole thing, because I'm not interested in what she has to say, because how are you, <laughs> I, I just... When I listened to it, the first thing that came to my mind was, thank you, God. Thank you so much for saving my life. Thank you for taking care of me. Thank you for, for, for protecting me. Like, I was just so grateful and so grateful. And God just put this in my spirit and I feel like I need to share it. Um, so, yeah, I just burst out in tears, which I might not do here. I just burst out in tears because I'm just shocked at how easily she says it like oh yeah we just drink each other's black blood and like as if it's a an okay thing to just randomly drink somebody's blood and the word that like or the scripture that god like put in my spirit immediately as soon as i started like crying and thanking him about how he's been good to me how he's been protecting me from all these things and he's been protecting so many people i was like i was literally screaming about how like i can't believe this is the reality that other people have to live with so the scripture that he gave me is ephesians 6 verse 10 so the full armor of god in ephesians 6 it says finally be strong in the lord and in the strength of his might put on the whole armor of god that you may be able to stand against the schemes of the devil for we do not wrestle against flesh and blood but against the rulers against the authorities against the cosmic powers over this present darkness against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly places therefore take up the whole armor of god that you may be able to stand to withstand in the day in the evil day and having done all to stand firm and the reason why i think the lord put this like in my heart so much and so profoundly is because um, the, the emphasis in the entire scripture is understanding that we have a real enemy, understanding that we have an enemy that's alive and present. If people can go out uh, to public media professing the activities that they are calling rituals, because um, the power of blood is, is, is 
beyond i feel like from an african context a lot of us are possibly going to understand how powerful blood sacrifices are or how much blood just binds you to something like like blood was the only thing that we needed to cleanse us as christians or to cleanse us as all of us like to give us freedom we needed a sacrificial lamb that jesus became that for us and the biggest thing that i want to echo today in today's holy perspective is that we are fighting a real enemy we are fighting a real devil he's not hiding he's not um timid he is not um afraid he's 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 present we are fighting a real devil we not we we don't just have a, an amazing god we also have a god of war like a god that wants to go into battle with you that wants to fight the battle for you and you just need to stand firm you need to put on your full armor like i just i can't emphasize this enough put on your full armor your salvation you believing in god is your helmet it's what protects your mind it's what protects you from uh, thoughts of anxiety thoughts of depression thoughts of suicide all of those things are all protected when you put on and you know your identity that you were saved by God and when you are saved by God you were given an assurity that you have a place in heaven you have eternity when you have tasted and seen the goodness of the Lord you will be able to know who you are and the only way to know who you are is to find out who you are read your Bible go through your word get to know yourself get to know and discover the God that lives in you and the spirit that's inside of you you have authority to tell the enemy to get thee behind me and he will flee you have the authority to tell the devil that not today not right now just 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 do something else go to somebody else you know and that's the one thing that I wanted to echo and emphasize. If you have not received salvation, feel free to private message me on my Instagram, DM me, like send me emails. I don't care. Let's just like, at this point, I'm just so frustrated and to see how like, yo, 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 I just... I feel like you can see my anger. Like you guys have never seen me like this, but this is how I am when I'm angry. And I just, yo... I just can't I just can't like we really need to put on our full armor we are fighting a real devil like we are fighting a real devil like he's not sleeping like this man is not sleeping this man will not let you rest until you die like he's not sleeping you need to rise up in your faith rise up in everything that you are doing rise up rise up serve god trust in the lord you've seen what god is capable of doing these people that have heard and have like yo, you've, you've, you've heard testimonies you've experienced testimonies you've seen god for yourself stand up today is like this is just a reminder if god has been speaking this to you this is just a reminder to go ahead and stand up because yo, the enemy that we are fighting is real people are sucking each other's blood for the sake of it like that on, on its own should get you thinking about where you are in your faith or where you are when eternity comes because we're not living for today we're not living for the now we are living for a future when we are living for eternity we're living to go into another world into a realm like our lives don't end here i remember this one time me and my friend were having a conversation and we were discussing how do you have you ever wondered that like this fleshly form this flesh this person that you see in front of this camera is not the real me like this is not like this is just a body i'm borrowing while i'm on earth when i leave i am a soul that's the true essence of who i am because my soul is the one that belongs with the lord this is where my spirit resides this is where everything uh resides and the enemy is fighting for your soul he don't he, he doesn't care about your body He's going to use your body to get to your soul. He's going to use money to get to your soul. He's going to use friends to get to your soul. He's going to use a party to get to your soul. He's going to use anything that he can. He's going to use like you idolizing artists to get to your soul. You idolizing things and not God to get to your soul. There's multiple things that he will do so that he doesn't go down alone. And the problem is the devil understands who you are except you. You don't understand who you are because you're not reading your word. You don't want to know the authority that you carry within you you don't want to know the power that comes with saying i am a christian or the power that comes with saying i believe in the holy spirit and i've been baptized in the holy spirit you have authority to uproot and take yo, 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 yo. Ah, i feel like if i just keep screaming this is gonna be a very scary video but let me just come down so 
just put on your full armor put on your helmet of salvation like i can't echo this enough if you are not saved ask yourself why haven't you been saved has god frustrated you i don't know where you're coming from i don't know where you stand but i just pray that you find peace in your heart i pray that this video becomes the echo that you needed to reach out for god more i pray that this video touches your heart that you want to desire more of god i pray that Yo, that you don't end up eating people's blood and speaking of it like it's not a hideous thing or a very like scary thing to do like i'm just i'm just yo guys mm -mm. yo the world that we're living in is a scary world it's a scary time to exist in the world right now and yeah it's a scary time and this is when now more than ever we need now more than ever now more than ever we need god we need god like now more than ever like i'm so scared i'm not gonna say i'm not scared in in the sense that i can't let's go devil you want to find me let's go now nah, i'm scared in, in in the sense that there's a lot of people that are going astray there's a lot of people that are not finding their salvation and i just pray like i just hope in my heart dearly that god gets to everyone that this video is supposed to reach and yeah i think i'm just gonna end it here because if i keep speaking this video is gonna be too long and i'm using a camera that's gonna take too long to edit so um i hope you guys enjoyed this video um don't forget to like comment share and subscribe i'm so sorry for screaming at you i'm just that bad um but run to the lord yo put on your full armor we are really fighting a real enemy like the devil is not hiding we need to admit that we're fighting a real enemy and yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video i'm gonna see you in the next video a video a video Yo! Yeah.